Hi, and welcome to this Power Walk Workout. Fun exercise program for you guys today. We have 30 seconds of walking, alternating with one whole minute of a power move. So we're working on bone density, your reaction time. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It is to the beat of the music with a timer. You can go at your own pace. I'm gonna go to the beat of the music. Let's go ahead and get started with our walk. Just a little walk in place. Shoulders back, core engaged. And our first power move is alternating front kicks. Here we go. Push the arms forward. And I want you to put a little snap in it. That's what's gonna give us that power. Again, a whole minute of that power move. Keep the feet, let's switch the arms, pushing out. Same thing, keep the legs, big kick, take the arms down. Snap them back behind you. Push it, push it. Legs don't have to be high. You got it, walk it out. Knees up. Next power move. Again, alternating sides. One leg and one arm out to the side, kind of like a one-sided jumping jack. But no jump, but with a push off. So definitely a little more bouncing in this type of workout. That's what's really gonna help. The slightly higher impact working on that bone density. You can always slow this down if you need to. Focus on that push off. You got it. Big step. Almost there. Walk it out. You can always walk it forward, walk it back. Get a more, little more miles as well as our steps in. All right, next coming up, we have a step back with a knee drive, all one leg. So tap that toe to the back, drive that knee up. Again, power behind it. This one we switch halfway through. Are you breathing? Switch sides. Knee up. Effort into that knee. Almost there. Ooh, walk it out. 
I can always come back to this walk. Catch your breath. Next, we're gonna do a slow squat down with a big power move up. Okay, so feet a little bit wider. We go down, two, three, push up. Down, two, three, push up. Stick those hips back, weight in the heels. Down, two, three, push up. If you wanted to, you could even come up onto those toes to really explode up. We could also lift our arms over the head. Down, two, three, push up. Down, two, three, push. You do you, make this your own. Walk it out. Good time to catch your breath on our walks. Next we have a little side bounce with a one arm jab. So I'm gonna turn to the side here. Feet together, we just take a little bounce here and then jab it forward, punch. About eye level. You can switch your feet back and forth, alternating that weight. And then again, put some power into it as you punch forward, lean into it. You got it. This one we switch halfway through. Switch. Keep it up. Almost there. Lean into it. Woo, walk it out. Third of the way through, guys. We have 15 power moves. We've just done five. We got this. All right, next, we can do a big side step touch or a little skater with a jump. You do you. Want you to try to get a little air, always landing with the knees bent. Tummy in. Again, always slow it down if you need to. Can you go a little further to the side? Breathe. Almost there. Woo, and walk. Catch your breath, big deep breath. All right, starting with that right leg, we're simply stepping forward and back, forward and back, 
So you can add a little jump or hop if you want for that power. Making the move a little more explosive is gonna burn some more calories. Still easy on the joints. You got it. Let's switch. And or just step it front and back. Push off. Walk it out. If you want, you can take that walk out, out, it in for a little variety. All right, next power move is two side steps to the left with the push. Big side step, big push. Out, in, out, push. The power move on this one is coming from that push. And then try to come up with a little twist there on your toe. You could add maybe a punch instead of the push if you wanted to. If that motivates you to get a little more power in there. Lock it out. How you guys doing? Stay with me. Let's do a posture check. Shoulders down and back. Tummy in. Make sure your hips are slightly tucked forward so you're not sticking the booty back. That way the lower back is supported. All right, next, super simple. We're just jumping rope. So shifting our weight foot to foot. Still low impact, right? Our feet aren't even leaving the mat or our carpet. Let's turn to the side. Let's turn to the back. Other side again. Back to the front. Other side quarter turn. To the back. To the side. And back to the front. Hold the jump rope. Almost there. Shoulders down. Don't let them creep up. Visible handles here. Shift that weight. Woo, and walk it. That one's a great one. Get that heart rate up. I'm gonna walk it forward. Walk it back. Hold it here. Next power move. Big wide stance. Toes turn to the corners. We step out and in, out and in. Slow this down if you need to. Out, really push it in. Powerful push, out and in. Again, toes turned slightly out to the corners. Straight spine. So no hunch in that back. Woo! 
Make this as small as you need to or as big as you've got. Almost there, guys. Woo, walk it out. All right, give me the energy. Two thirds of the way there. Next, we have two steps, little hop, front and back. So we go right, left, right, left, up, up, back, back. You can always walk this, right? And if you're feeling it, up, up, back, back. And this one, we switch our lead halfway through. And switch. Big hop or walk. And walk. Nice job. Next power move is turning to the side, just moving one leg into like a small squat or just a step out. 10 more seconds. So we're gonna take that right leg Left leg doesn't move. We step out, twist back. Out, twist back. If you have osteoporosis, no twist, okay? You're gonna keep straight. If you're okay, add that torso twist in there. Great for the core. Power twist back. At your own pace. Excellent, let's switch. Okay, this time, right leg doesn't move. Twist. Really push off that leg. Oh, you should be feeling those thighs. And walk. Ooh, shake that out. Almost there, guys. Knees up. Okay, next we have a little, call it a pop-up star. So we go down, lift, down, lift. Lift the leg to the side, a couple more slow. I'm gonna make it speed it up. Here we go, lift. Get that leg out to the side. The harder you, the harder it'll be, the higher you bring those arms up. So you do you. Whew, stay with me. Press those shoulders down. Don't let them help. And walk. A 
Less than five minutes left, guys. Stay with me. What we're doing next is a knee twist. Really works the core with a little crunch. Just the right leg, twist. Again, osteoporosis, I want you to bring it straight. Everyone else, twist. Slow it down if you need to. And switch. Get that twist in to really work the core. can always just do the knee. Breathe with me. And walk. Woo! You guys, one more power move. Breathe and smile. I swear it helps. We're having fun, getting tons of steps in. All right, our last move, alternating little kicks to the front with a little tricep throw. So again, here's your power. I don't want you to jar the joint, but I want you to have a little snap in there. Think about you have a ball you're throwing overhand in both hands, a little kick, a little throw. Good, bend those knees. Try to get the elbows up so you really feel it in that tricep. Almost there. Slow walk. Wipe the sweat off. Nice job. Can we keep this nice slow march here? Big inhale, arms come up. Exhale down. Again, inhale. Exhale down. Slow side tap here. Catch that breath. Stretching out that back. And let's change that to overhead. Good. Lace those fingertips together. Turn them inside out. Push them towards me. Shoulders down. Go ahead and bend the knees round the back and push those arms towards me. Inhale, exhale if it feels good for you. You can lean all the way over for a beautiful hamstring stretch as well. Release the hands, put them on top of your thighs, tuck your tailbone, tuck your chin, and roll it up nice and slow. Excellent, same thing to the back. Lace those fingertips back behind you. Try to straighten those elbows, shoulders down and back. Very gently lift up if you can. Stretching out that chest. This is a great one for our posture. Inhale. Exhale, a little bend in the knees. And again, tilt forward, gently pulling up if that feels okay for you. Release the hands again on top of the thighs. Tuck the tailbone, tuck the chin. Roll it up one vertebrae at a time. A little flex in that front foot. Hinge over for a hamstring stretch again. Inhale. 
exhale. Good, feet together, other side. Heel on the floor, toe to the ceiling. Hinge forward. Nice straight spine here. And bring that foot back. Widen that stance just a bit. Arms out to the side. Let's twist all the way over and then opposite hand towards the opposite toe. Back up, twist to the side. Opposite hand towards opposite toe. And come on back up, hands on the hips. Drop the chin, slowly roll that head to the right. Back through center, over to the left. Shoulders down one more time each side. Toe heel slightly back in, give me a big inhale. Arms come up, release them down. Give yourself a pat on the back for a job well done. Thanks for working out with me. Let me know how many steps you took in the comments. I'll write it in the description below. Thanks for working out with me, and I'll see you next time.